Hello, I'm Kelsey Kushner. Thanks for joining us tonight on CBS Baltimore. Tonight, with students set to return to Edmondson Westside High School in the morning, neighbors stopped to remember a 16 year old student killed and four others hurt in a shooting near campus four days ago. Surveillance cameras in the area captured these images of two persons of interest. One appears to be holding a gun in their hand, and Baltimore City Police have been asking for your help finding them. WJZ is live at 6:30. Jessica Alpert joins us outside Edmondson Westside High School with more. Jessica. Hey Kelsey. Well, there was a peace vigil held tonight for 16-year-old Deontay Dorsey. He is the victim who was shot and killed in that shooting. The goal of the vigil was to bring peace to the space where the 16-year-old died and to let the the family of his family know, let his family know that the community supports them. A small group gathered outside the Popeyes in the Edmondson Village Shopping Center Sunday to honor 16 year old Deontay Dorsey. The Baltimore Peace Movement, which used to be called Baltimore Ceasefire 365, burned sage to bring peace to where Deontay lost his life. There are community members hurting, family members hurting, and we love to show up in these spaces to pour love and light there. Let there be joy. Let there be peace. It happened January 4th. Baltimore police say Deontay and four of his classmates had walked across the street to the restaurant on their lunch break and were outside the restaurant when two gunmen opened fire, hitting all five. Police released these photos of two people, possible suspects in the shooting. This is not the only shooting involving students this week in the city. A 15-year-old girl and 16-year-old boy were shot near Benjamin Franklin High School in South Baltimore on Friday. They survived. With all of the violence taking a toll on families across the city, the Baltimore Peace Movement hopes this vigil will bring some peace to Deontay's family and others. Just hearing that people who didn't even know your loved one showed up to honor them and to love them and to honor the, the, their space, that is a new perspective for people in the middle of their grief. Edmondson Westside High School will hold its first full day of classes tomorrow. They had a half day on Friday. If you know anything about this shooting with uh, that killed Deontay or the one in South Baltimore, you're asked to contact Baltimore Police. Reporting live in Baltimore, Jessica Albert for WJZ.